So unfortunately, Matt is not available, but I will be singing tonight. Just kidding. Just kidding, everyone. Matt is here to perform an amazing acoustic set just for you to celebrate 10 years of ESO. Please welcome Matthew Hafey. How is it? Good evening. Yeah, yeah. How y'all doing tonight? Good to see you. I had a hellish trip to get here. Um, I was actually supposed to be here yesterday, and um, everything went wrong. Every single flight I was supposed to take, every single connection kept getting canceled. So I actually got here this morning. And uh, yes, it is my absolute pleasure to be here. I'm so excited to be here. So naturally, we would have sound checked everything yesterday. So we're going to have to do a quick little line check, which I know is not the most entertaining thing in the world. But we've got to do that. So where is everyone from tonight? Some people from Holland. I heard some people from Australia, Germany. Anyone from the States? Where are you all from? Yeah, everybody. So yeah, awesome. I'll, I'll start busting out all the language. So Huchatet, Vigets, Que pasa? All right. Anyway. Oh, sorry. In, in the, of course, the travel fashion, something went out already. Just a second. <laughs> One sec. So we're going to do a line check quick first, because we were going to do that yesterday when I, came, when I was supposed to come in yesterday. But we're going to do that now. So I was initially flying yesterday morning, and the first flight got canceled and rerouted. Then the next one got canceled and rerouted. And then finally, we ended up getting over here this morning. Oh, crap. Sorry. We're off to a great start, everybody. That's a great start. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Let's check the vocal level real quick. Check, 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 check. Uh, Def, I might need you, dude. Something happened to the guitar. This is the ultimate professionality right here. Um, so we'll check the vocals real quick then. Um, <clears throat> As I crawl through dirt and mud, I'm sinking under in a grave of life that was a sunlight. I turn my back on everything, search for every member dreams. Cool. I think we're good. Yeah. All right, cool. So once we get this tuning thing going, then we'll be all good. So yes, a little jet lagged, but I'm absolutely ready. I'm incredibly honored to be here at this 10 year celebration of Elder Scrolls Online. Very, very excited. Got a lot of songs for you today. So if you don't know the band I'm in, Trivium, that's okay, because I'm playing a lot of other stuff from a lot of different things. Some things you'll recognize, some things you might not. I've got a debut from one of my favorite video games of all time as well. So yes, I've been plagued with a lot of things happening, a lot of technical things. So I figured something like this would happen. Thanks, Def. Thank you, Will. All right, without any further ado, I think you know this song. I hurt myself today to see if I still feel I focus on the pain, the only thing that's real. The needle tears a hole, the old familiar sting. Try to kill it all the way, but I remember everything. What have I become? My sweetest friend, everyone I know goes away again, and you could have it all. My empire of death, I will let you down. I will. Well, the 
this crown of thorns upon my liar's chair full of broken thoughts I cannot repair beneath the stains of time the feelings disappear you are someone else I am still right here what have I become my sweetest friend everyone I know goes away in the end and you could have it all my empire of death I will let you down I will make you hurt If I could start again A million miles away I would keep myself I would find Tá aqui, Bel, tá aqui, Bel. Ah, now we're off to a good start. So as I was saying earlier, my name is Matt. It's my absolute pleasure to be here. I've been good pals with the ESO folks for a very long time. We'll get more and more into that as this set goes on. But tonight's a bunch of songs that I love to play, songs by other artists like Roy Orbison. Uh, there's a song by Jack Black in here tonight from the first video game I ever beat in my entire life, which is probably the first video game you ever beat as well. Um, so we're gonna play a couple more songs, a couple more oldies and got a, yeah, got a lot of fun stuff tonight. I was really stoked to see knights fighting here. That was freaking amazing. I want that every day. I want to see that every show I play from now on. All right. Now, unfortunately, I have 10 albums of Trivium stuff taking up the hard drive, so that's why I've always have sheet music for the covers. And sometimes people feel like, hey, Matt, play this song or play that song. Like, man, my brain is so full of the Trivium stuff and, like, my useless knowledge of food things or video game trivia that we've got sheet music here. So if you know any of these songs, please sing with me, my friends. Sing with me. So this song, this song's a nice one. Falling in love with 
Thank you very much. Now, I noticed this the last acoustic show I played, because normally we play, I've got the full band and the full stage theatrics and all that. I noticed the weirdest parts of these sets are when I go for water breaks. And I'm like, you know, so there's no music, there's no background stuff, I'm just like drinking out of this water bottle. You're gonna start to notice it more and more. I probably shouldn't have pointed it out, but. <laughs> all right. All right, so another, this, you'll see this set list kind of ramps up in the vocal pitch, so I kind of start down in Elvis and I kind of make my way up to Jack Black. So we'll, we'll, we'll do that together. <laughs> All right. a secret chord that David played and it pleased the Lord but you don't really care for music do you it goes like this the fourth the fifth the minor fall the major left the baffled king composing hallelujah She cut your hair and from you Thank you, Thank you, Bill. There's the awkward water break. <laughs> all right, let's pick up the pace a little bit. So this next song, all these songs I picked tonight thinking they would be very, very good bard songs. I've always said I wish I could do more bard music. I feel like I have that bard range. So I decided to take a bunch of songs and kind of transform that to this. This next song is absolutely like the drinking style song. It's if you've got your Viking horn. 
now's the time. If you don't know this song, during the chorus, it does this clap thing that we have to do together, okay? It's like, it's, I'll show you exactly what it is so we all know what this was going on. Yeah, uh, when we get to it, I'll explain it. I was trying to, trying to show you there, but my brain glitched. Okay, so this one's a lot of fun. This is uh, initially an Irish folk song. And being 37% Irish, I can say this, the Irish folk song is usually just songs about drinking. So I think you'll know this song. If you don't know this song, you'll have it by the second chorus. Do the clapping, do the singing, here we go. I've been a wild rover for many a year. I spent all my money on whiskey and beer. But now I'm returning with golden great store. And I never will play the world over no more And it's no, they never clap here No, they never no more Will I play the world over No, never no more Let me show that goes, so it goes And it's no, nay, never No, nay, never no more Will I play the world over No, never no more I went into an alehouse I used to frequent And I told the landlady me money was spent I asked her for credit, she answered me nay Such custom as yours I could have any day And it's no, nay, never No, nay, never, no more Will I play the wild rover? No, never, no more pocket, ten sovereigns bright, and the landlady's eyes open wide with delight. She said, I have whiskeys and wines on the best, and the words that I told you were only in jest, and it's no, nay, never, no, nay, never, no more, will I play the wild rover, no, never, no more. I go home to my parents, confess what I've done, and ask them to pardon the prodigal son. And when they've caressed me as I've times before, I never will play the wild rover no more. And it's no, nay, never. No, nay, never, no more. Will I play the wild rover? No, never, no more. One more time, and it's no, nay, never. No, nay, never, no more Will I play the wild rover? No, never, no more Yeah, there we go. Y'all sounded great on that one. Lovely, lovely claps. See, I was trying to describe it before, but I was trying to play it cool because I could not remember what the song sounded like till we were in it, and that's why I stopped. That's the fun thing about these acoustic things. I get to be a lot more myself for the Trivium sets. It's very, very intense. I got to make sure everything is on, on the clock, and if I start telling jokes, usually my bandmates will look at me like, all right, dude, wrap it up. But here, I have the microphone, so I can be a goofball and mess up and things. So you might hear some errors. You might hear some squeaks. You might hear some stuff there was... It wasn't bothering me because I've got five-year-olds, so I'm used to the sound, but on the flight over, I finally fell asleep. I was like, I have to sleep for this show. Finally fell asleep, baby started screaming. So I woke up with the baby, and I was just kind of chilling. I was like, what's up, baby? Uh, so yeah, if you hear some squeaks, that's why. <laughs> so, are the knights fighting right now or something? Yeah, it's something. Ah, next is one of my band songs. Okay, so if you know the band Trivium, that's the band I'm in. That's the stuff I mostly do. I'll need you to sing with me, okay? And get my mix just right. Check, 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 yep. This is Dying in Your Arms Off Ascendancy. I'm wearing thin, wearing out, becoming weak, holding hands with this rope. She's myself destructive. It makes it hard to breathe But if I stop you far away It's fixated And now I see it's you That's having me and snapping me This is me dying in your arms I cut you and now set me It's tie up on what used to be And her candles but for me So I escape cut this new summer I will 
mind The cabin free to say the things you fly to me Get a shop you're far away You want to tell to me But now I see it's you that's tearing me This is me tying in your arms I cut you and you set me But now I see it's you that's tearing me Almost. This is me tying in your arms. I cut you well, now set me free. You poisoned my life, so I take this knife and I cut you out. Cut you I don't know why I started doing that mouth trumpet thing, but it seems appropriate and it seems to work. How freaking cool is this stage setup? I want this stage setup for my band. This is pretty awesome. <laughs> All right, so we got a couple more tracks for you, a whole bunch of tracks. Um, this next song is a song called Strife, so if you know Trivium, you'll probably know this song as well. Sorry, more tuning. The most pro thing, just, just tuning, hanging out with my friends. Is everyone having a good time this year, yeah? This 10-year celebration, I absolutely love it. I am so stoked to be here. Um, ESO has given me so many amazing opportunities, so many amazing things have opened the gates thanks to ESO. I grew up with video games. I was born in Japan, um, moved to California right away, so was, my dad was in the Marines. So it was my mom and I, and she just kind of raised me which, with what she knew, and that was video games, and then eventually like anime and things like that. So I remember beating Mario 1 when I was five, and I remember the first time I ever played Doom when I was 10 or 11. I said, I really want to make music like that someday. I didn't know what that was. I didn't know that was metal yet, but I knew I wanted to make some kind of music like that for video games, because I really fell in love with games. And ESO partnered up with Trivium, put a Trivium song in an expansion, and all this amazing stuff happened. And since then, I've finally been getting hit up by gaming companies to do music for them, which is so freaking awesome. It's, and it's just such an absolute honor. I'm so excited. And that's thanks to ESO. That's thanks to the relationship with them. So they've really made some dreams come true. And um, yeah, it's, it's absolutely amazing to be here. Very, very stoked. Sorry, one sec. Fresh strings. Hey, if we were in a tavern right now, I would be tuning too. Like if this were, you know, non-technology days. Okay, so this next song is called Strife. If you know it, please sing along. If you don't know it, maybe you'll have it by the second course or so. Decayed and not be bound in madness. 
This is a song off our album, In Waves. That is our fifth album? Yes, so here we go. Took away all of this pain. Left us like it's all in vain. Left us like it's all in vain. Blindingly it seeps through the tree. Burning my subconscious dreams, falling like this mental dream. We are too far gone. We are too far gone. We are too far gone. We were never meant to make it this far. I feel the rage, and it burns the pages of all these yesterdays. I'm caught. Practicing for death alone, practicing for death alone. Hope is gone cold with its cause. Lost inside its every flaw, life is fine and swallowed raw. We are too far gone. We are too far gone. We are too far gone. We were never meant to make it this far. I feel the rage and it burns the pain. I'm covered fast in the falling ashes of all these yesterdays. With the end in sight, 
I glance what's left of a light Pressing against my head And dream of the color red With the end in sight I glance what's left of a light Pressing against my head And dream of the color red I feel the rage And it burns the pages Of all of these yesterdays Is everyone having a good time at this event? Yes? 10 years celebration of one of the greatest freaking games of all time. I love it. So very excited. I'm having a blast. All right, so this next one, we got, I know it's like a trivium cluster here, and then we'll get back in a couple more songs that maybe you'll know if you don't know me. But once again, I'm in the band Trivium. I joined the band when I was 12 and a half, so it was my first band, first job. It's the only thing I've ever done in my entire life, so basically 26 years of the same thing, and it's been freaking awesome. I get to play metal on stage, get to play metal on acoustic over here during video game things. It's freaking awesome. I absolutely love it, so thank you so much. This next song. It's another one off in waves. If you know it, sing it. If you don't, you'll learn it. Here we go. Single pain, nothing that 
You're beautiful. Thank you. I even just saw it on the screen. That water drink thing is always so weird. I gotta figure something out. I don't know if there should be like a like a like a backdrop I hide behind or something between songs. Now maybe that's too much. Think about it too much. Y'all still having fun? Huh? Huh? Y'all gonna start moshing yet? No, you can't really mosh an acoustic set, I guess. I guess you could, but maybe maybe we don't have to. It's up to you. So Trivium news. Um, Trivium is taking this whole year off. This is my only European appearance all year, which is pretty awesome. Just here hanging out with Elder Scrolls. Um, next year, we just announced it, so if you're just getting to know Trivium, maybe you don't know us, but maybe you know our co-touring partners. So us and a band called Bullet For My Valentine are doing a, we're doing a co-worldwide tour where we're both playing our fan favorite records. That'd be our album, Ascendancy, and their album, The Poison. Both albums turn 20 next year, so that's what that is. We're absolutely coming to this country. We're coming to every single country, so make sure you come check that out, because that's kind of a once-in-a-lifetime event right there. Yes. Let's see what we got here. So this next song is one of my favorite songs in the world to play. I first was introduced to Roy Orbison in the movie Blue Velvet, which I know is a pretty intense movie if you've seen that. One of my good friends, I call him my man muse. His name is John Paul Douglas. He's the guy that got me into all sorts of different art styles, music styles that really became inspirational on the In Waves record. And as you just heard, if that was your first time hearing some In Waves material, that was those last two songs. But this was a song that, this is one of the only songs in my life I'll do at karaoke. Like, there's nothing else other than this one. So this is one, I love this song. It's called In Dreams it's by Roy Orbison. Well, let's do it. Candy cut a clown, they call the Sandman. Tiptoes to my room every night Just to sprinkle stardust and to whisper Go to sleep, everything is alright I close my eyes Then I drift away Into the magic night I softly say a silent prey like dreamers do then i fall asleep to dream my dreams of you in dreams i walk with you in dreams i talk to you in dreams your mind all the time we're together in dreams in dreams but just before the dawn I wake and find you gone I can't help it I can't help it I remember that you said goodbye. It's too bad that all these things can only happen in my dreams. Thank you. Yep, that is a very, very fun song to play. I was thinking about the high note later in the song, and it made me do another high note flat, but like I said, that stuff's, that stuff's inevitable sometimes. This next song, if you are a fellow metalhead, and what I've always felt and I've always believed deep in my heart that video games and the people that are drawn to video games, all of us, obviously, and the people that are drawn to metal, some of us in here, I feel like those two worlds have always been very similar. And my entire life with games, I started getting into metal, obviously, subconsciously through things like Doom, but also Final Fantasy, like the battle music of Final Fantasy IV, Final Fantasy VI, Final Fantasy VII. Those are all very metal riffs. And when I got into metal later on, I started looking back. I was like, oh, that's kind of like Rainbow. That's kind of like Dio. That's kind of like Iron Maiden. So I urge you, if you are fans of Elder Scrolls Online, like obviously you all are, 
and you don't know metal yet, start checking some stuff out. Like there is so much of the same source material of, in my opinion, the best genre of games like ESO and what metal is doing. So maybe this will be the, the gateway into you getting into that. So this next song is off one of my favorite albums from one of my favorite metal bands called Opeth. And this is off the Blackwater Park album. So yeah, it's always one of my favorite ones, but you'll see how it has a very ESO feel in it. It absolutely does. You'll see, you'll see what I'm talking about in a minute uh, if you don't know the track, but if you do know the track, sing it with us. These new strings hate me today. <laughs> Sorry. Normally I've got Tex, I've got, well, I've got Deformance. Deformance, thank you so much. Because I was supposed to be here yesterday for the sound check, but I was still in Florida with weather delays. Florida, it's sunshine or it's freaking hurricanes, that's it. So this is Harvest by Opeth.
Thank you very much. Thank you, Bill. Thank you, Bill. All right, let's see what's next. Ooh, this next one's fun. Okay, I think everyone should know this next song. I really wanted to play the song, so I was so stoked on ESO and so inspired by them. I wrote this song called What Kind of Death Will I Find? Maybe next time that they have me back, I'll play that song, but that's online. That's a really cool song, fully written and inspired by ESO and the ESO world and the music that Brad makes. So hope you dig that one of these days. So this next song, I'll play it. I'll see if you know it. I might need your help. So if any vocal squeaks come in, pretend you didn't hear it and that was the person next to you. Jeez. Yeah, it has been rife with technical stuff on my way over, but it feels so good to play for you all right now. So I'm, I'm really, I'm really hoping you have a good time. Yeah. All right, sing this with me. I know you know this one. When a humble bond graced a ride along with Geralt of Rivia, along came this song. From when the wife of fought a silver-tongued devil, his army of bells had a soothed to they rebel. They came after me with master for the seed, broke down my loot and they kicked in my teeth. While the devil's horns minced our tender meat, and so cried the witcher, he can't be played. Toss a coin to your witcher, a valley of plenty, a valley of plenty, oh, oh, oh. Toss a coin to your witcher, a valley of plenty. At the edge of the world, fight the mighty horde that bashes and breaks you. Every elf fall back on the shelf, high up on the mountain from whence it came. He wiped out your best, got kicked in his chest. He's a friend of humanity, so give him the best. That's my epic tale. Our champion prevailed, defeated the villain. Now pour him some mail. Toss a coin to your winter, a valley of plenty. Toss a coin to your winter, a valley of plenty, a valley of plenty, ha ha. Toss a coin to your winter, a fate of humanity. Hey. Thank you. Glad that hideout worked. I was thinking about it. I ask you again, is everyone having a good time tonight? Yes. So I'm back tomorrow. Tomorrow I'd love to meet all of your faces and shake all your hands and chat about fun stuff. So I'm back tomorrow. So if you're here tomorrow, I'm here during that, during the, I think, afternoon time around like two or something. So please come on back down if you're here. I really wanted to do the night stuff. When I saw the night battles, I was like, I wish I showed up yesterday because that would have been so fun to do. Maybe, maybe tomorrow we can, we can night battle or something. You and I, yeah? We down for that? <laughs> Apologies. That's what I get for using a capo. The reason why I'm using this thing is because it's, you know, I like to shift up the original keys of the song we're covering. And it's always. All right, since you knew the last one, you're gonna know this one as well. And this is one of my favorite songs to do. It's acoustic stuff. And the acoustic stuff's really fun because like, when you all come to see us next year, now that we're all friends, when you come to see Trivium Bullet on that tour, you'll see how different the sets are. And this, this is one of my favorite things to do. I, I love doing this. So without further ado. I know you know this one. I hear you're alive. Disappointing. I've also survived, no thanks to you. Did I not believe 
some claim, Mr. Oh, look at me. Now I burn all the memories of you. All those lonely nights that you hide. Now you walk with no one by your side. Did you ever? With your sword in your stupid hair Now watch me laugh As I burn all the memories of you Ladies and gentlemen, you've been the most beautiful I've ever tossed court again If anyone needs me, I'll be at the bar What for the year Is the point of no return After everything we did, we saw You turned your back on me What for the year At the end of my days when I'm through No word that I've written will break what is true It's bad, bad, but you're bad Burn, put your burn, 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 burn. Watch me burn Thank you. That's a fun one. Very fun one to do. So a little backstory on me, even though I'm giving you a little bit of backstory. So when I was 11, I was in, what, seventh grade, seventh grade? In Central Florida, you didn't really grow up with metal. Um, I know people talk about the death metal days, but death metal was more like 1991 to 1997, and I was, what, six, seven years old or so. So in Central Florida, the things that you got into were pop punk, ska, or boy bands. So I got into pop punk and ska before I ever knew metal. I picked up guitar because I was like, I wanted to look cool and I didn't know what else to do. So I picked up guitar and these kids that I knew, they were a grade older, they said, well, try out for our band. And my tryout song was Damn It by Blink-182. And I thought I was good. I'd only been playing guitar for a couple of weeks. I tried out, I never got the call back. So when I didn't get the call back, I was like, you know what, screw this. I'm, I'm not playing guitar anymore. I'm, I'm going home, I'm done. So I, I gave up on, on the dream, but a couple of weeks later, a kid lent me the Black Album by Metallica. And I went home and heard that. I was like, okay, this is the kind of music I'm supposed to be doing. From there, I locked myself in my room, play guitar nonstop. And then I played my eighth grade talent show covering No Leaf Clover. Trivium asked me to try out for the band. They existed for two weeks, but they already lost a guitar player. I tried out, joined, and have been in ever since. So, Damn It by Blink-22. That was the first song, the first tryout of anything that I was ever supposed to do. I couldn't play it. Ironically, when I was warming this up today, just before the set, I still messed up the guitar solo for this song, even though it's just like... I messed it up. So it could happen, but this other part's gonna sound great. So. Here's my rendition of the tryout song that never came to fruition. This is Damn It. Are already messed up. Scepter to a channel with Prime. A day late, a buck short. I'm writing the report. I'm losing and failing. When I move, I'm flailing now. And it's happened once again. I'll turn to a friend. Someone that understands, sees through the master plan. But everybody's gone. And I've been here for too long to face this on my own. Well, I guess this is growing up. I guess this is growing, and maybe I'll see you at a movie sneak preview. You'll 
show up and walk by on the arm of that dark elf necromancer. And I'll smile and you'll wave, we'll pretend it's okay, the charade, it won't last when he's gone, I won't come back, and it'll happen once again, you'll turn to a friend, someone that understands, sees through the master plan, but everybody's gone, you'll be for too long to face this on your own well i guess this is growing up well i guess this is growing up damn it Any other uh, dark elf necromancers in here? No, just me. All right, fine. Fine. If that's how it is. Let's see how it is. <laughs> All right. This next song. If I mess it up, it'll kind of make it better. So that, that's a good thing. All right. I'm very excited to play this one. Can't believe I'm doing this. I think this is on the front page of Twitch too, and they're all going to see this. Like this metal guy doing this ridiculous thing. All right, here we go. This is for my one and only true love, Princess Peach. Peach, you're so cool. And with my star, we're gonna rule. Peach, you understand. I'm gonna love you till the very end. Peaches, 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 I love you. Mario, Luigi, and I'm Donkey Kong too. A thousand troops of Koopas couldn't keep me from you. A princess speech at the end of the line. Now make it mine. Oh, peaches, 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 peaches. <laughs> I was like, is this Brian Johnson note going to work tonight or not? But it worked. <laughs> all right. Oh, that song's so cool. You all know, in the beginning of that movie, when they play the Beasties, be the Beasties, the Beastie Boys song, No Seat to Brooklyn, that's Kerry King playing the guitar solo. And I was thinking in my head, like, does Kerry King know that his solo is in the Mario Brothers movie? I would be so freaking stoked. That would be the moment I'm like, all right, I'm good, I'm good. See y'all later. Maybe, maybe that's why the Slayer Farewell thing, they're like, you know what, I'm in Mario's, see ya. Well, they're back too, which is freaking awesome. All right, so, man, time just flew like crazy. That's nuts. Like, man, this guy's tuning again. So, my friends, once again, I want to say what an absolute treat this was. This was truly incredible to be able to do. Thank you so much for allowing me to be in your home tonight and welcoming me as one of your own. Thank you so much. The ESO team, thank you so much for everything you've done. Like I said, they've, they've helped open up gateways into another dream of mine. I'd never imagined I'd be able to make music that lives in video games or now in movies. I'm doing Deathgasm 2, which I'm super excited about. One of my dear friends, Kendall Deacon Davis, he's one of the guys from Halo, who's the lead writer for the ARC animated series. He and I are bootstrapping and making our own game together called Kunoichi. It's me, this Japanese side-scroller game. I'm doing all the music, got the shamisen. I got 15 Japanese instruments waiting for me to learn them. So it's going to be a good old time. So yes, be on the, be on the lookout for that. But it's, it's, it's all thanks to ESO, truly, truly. If they didn't take a chance on 
on Trivium, take a chance on me and allow us to come into your amazing community all these multiple times, I truly believe that those doors would have opened up for me. So thank you so much, ESO team. Thank you for everything. Gina, thank you for helping me try to reroute my flights and then my good friend Deform is doing my sound check for me and all this stuff. This wouldn't have happened without all the incredible team behind everything. And thank you all very much for being here as well. With that being said, songs I really know. So yeah, here we go. This is Trivium's Until the World Goes Cold. If you know it, please sing it with me, okay? Sing it loud, I'll sing it loud too. As I crawl through dirt and mud, I'm sinking under, in a grave of life that burns a song. Until the world goes cold Until the world goes cold As I build my house of bones You're sinking under For all you see to win the tone I burn me down I turn my back on everything I search for every member dreams You know, in the Minions movies, I don't know if any of you watched that, my kids love the Minions movies, they actually say Teddy Makasi, and I was like, kids, that's Indonesian for thank you very much, and my kids are like, <laughs> yeah, they, they like that, yeah, yeah, they like that a lot, why aren't they over here? Oh, the, oh they're doing it over there. <laughs> All right, so... I could do this forever. I don't want to bore you all. My friends, once again, thank you so much. This has been a blast. Anytime y'all will have me, I would gladly come right on back. It's been amazing. It's been amazing to be pals of the ESO people, and now you are all my new pals as well. Once again, I'm Matt from Trivium. Let's check out Trivium. Check out all that stuff. Thank you very much. This is the final song of the night. The chorus is easy, so hopefully you have it down. I encourage all of you to sing this with me. You should have it down by the second chorus. And once again, I'm here tomorrow, so I'd love to say hello. Let's, let's make sure we're two first. 
Well, it was my idea. I was like, hey, Def, let's put on Deformance. That's my, my main Twitch mod, dude, that helps with my PCs and all that stuff. I was like, hey, let's put on new strings before the show. That was my idea. Sorry, Def. Thanks for your help, buddy. Talk you well. What will it take to rip the heart from your head? It's easy to be right when everything repeats. It's easier to cut us down and put it out of feet. It's easy to be right when everything repeats. Sick below the surface, find your insecurities. Tell me, maybe you were right, maybe I was wrong. But I've been silent for far too long. Maybe you were right, maybe I should go. But I've been silent for far too long. What did it take to rip the heart from your head? What did it take? What did it take to rip the heart from your head? To rip the heart from your head. walk away soon you'll have to face it your distance from reality will be your reset i tried to do the same appearing so complacent but the problems wouldn't go away so i turn around to face them tell me maybe right maybe i was wrong but i've been silent for far too long maybe right maybe i should go but I've been silent for far too long. Who I be to take to rip the heart from your head? Who I be to take? Who I be to take to rip the heart from your head? was wrong, but I've been silent for far too long. What did it take to rip the heart from your head? What did it take? What did it take to rip the heart from your head? y'all very 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 much my name is matt hafey it was an absolute pleasure to play for y'all and hang with you all we'll see you tomorrow my friends thank you very much eso it's been an absolute pleasure thank you all thank you all